What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can see by the title, we have a brand new Primark haul. Now I haven't been to Primark in actually what feels like forever, which is kind of crazy because it is definitely one of my favorite shops. You guys know I personally love Primark because everything is just so affordable there and I feel like you can get a lot for your money. So I went in and I actually picked out a lot of things. So I thought I would do a haul for you guys. I kind of feel like we're in this like weird transitional period where it's going from winter into almost spring and and I kind of just got a bunch of things that I might not necessarily wear like right now, but I definitely would take on holiday. So if there is a couple of items that are a little bit more like summery, then please don't mind. I'm not just going crazy. I am just kind of thinking ahead a little bit. If you guys are brand new here and you haven't seen my face before, hi, I'm Roxy, welcome to my channel. If you guys want to stick around, make sure you guys subscribe down below. But if you guys want to see what I picked up from Primark this time, then let's get on into the video. Okie dokie, I literally have one, and two massive bags from Primark. These are so freaking heavy. So the first thing that I initially saw as soon as I walked into the Primark, I actually went to the Primark in Oxford and they have so many cute things. I actually saw this right by the entrance and I just had to get it because it is the cutest bag ever. I personally love these rattan slash wicker kind of bags. It really reminds me of Bali because they have so many in Bali like that. These sort of bags really remind me of like holidays. I love wearing bags like this to the beach and that kind of thing. It's just got that really cool boho kind of vibe to it. But of course this one has kind of like a faux leather top so it makes it a little bit more like appropriate for day to day use. I just fell in love with it. I think it's so cute and look at the way it opens up. It kind of just makes me think of like a picnic kind of basket. So I really, really like this bag. This bag cost 10 pounds, which I feel like it's not a bad price to pay at all. It has also got a long strap. So I feel like it's a really nice universal bag. So yes, this is my first item. And honestly, I've got to say, this is probably my most favorite bag that I've bought in a long time. Now the next item I got is actually a dress. So this is kind of where it gets into that stage where it's like, is this really appropriate for the season? It probably isn't, but I still really, really liked it. So here it is. This is a dress and it's kind of got like a collar sort of vibe. I really, really love the sleeves. They're kind of like puffed, but not too much. The color is so pretty as well. And I've got to say this dress is quite lightweight. So that's why I'm saying it's probably not really appropriate for like right now, especially here in the UK. But for spring and summer, I can totally see myself wearing this and maybe even on like a holiday. I feel like this is a really nice Nice, easy dress to wear. This dress was really inexpensive. It was only 13 pounds and I am just in love with how it looks. I love the color. I love how lightweight it is. Now I got this in a size 10. I usually would have gone for a size eight, but they didn't have any. So I just had to settle for this, but I feel like it's still gonna fit me pretty well. So I'm really happy with it. Okay, so this next item I'm so obsessed with. You guys are gonna love it because it kind of gives me like misguided vibes. It doesn't look like it's from Primark, if you know what I mean. So here it is. This is a really cool blouse slash jumper. It's got a very sporty kind of look to it. And I really, really love the block colors. I think they're so on trend. And you guys just know I love anything beige slash nude or brown. So this is just literally perfect. I also really like it because it's kind of got like a button up high neck collar as well as a pocket. Like this actually has a giant pocket right in the middle, which is a little bit different. At the bottom, you can also like cinch it in. So it's a little bit more like fitted, which is really nice. Now this one cost 12 pounds, which again is not a bad price at all. And it's really nice and fleecy on the inside, which I feel like is gonna be so cozy. I got this in a size extra small because I felt like it's a little bit baggy already and I didn't want it to be too oversized. So this is the perfect size for me. Okay, the next item I got is a little jumper. Now, you guys know I love turtlenecks, jumpers, anything that's like really cozy, especially around this time of year. So I decided to pick this up. It looks very, very simple and plain from the front. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty much just a ribbed high neck kind of jumper, but the party is definitely at the back of it. Look at this. How freaking awesome is that? Like it has a two-tone kind of look to it and it's only at the back. So like from the front, it's all one color apart from the sleeve. And then it's got this back panel, which is so cool. I just thought this was so different. It was actually hanging like this on the hanger. So when I saw it, I was like, oh my God, this is perfect. Like two nude colors together. This is my kind of jam. But then when I picked it up, I realized that that's actually the back of it. So that's kind of a shame. But I feel like you could wear it either way, to be honest. So I've got to say, this one was actually a really big bargain because originally this cost 10 pounds, but then it was reduced to five pounds. And I was a little bit like, 
why is this reduced? Because this is so on trend. It's really nice and it had loads left. So yeah, if you live near the Oxford Primark and you like to shop there, then make sure you go ahead and pick it up if you like this because this is gonna go real quick. It's only five pounds. The next two items I'm so excited about and if you're a Riverdale fan like me, you're also gonna really like these. So I don't know if you guys knew, but Primark has like a whole range of clothing kind of like in collaboration with lots of different tv shows there was like friends stranger things they always do things with harry potter and disney and recently they actually started doing things with riverdale which i was just so happy about so the first item i got is this Whoa. So the first item I got is this little crop top. Look how freaking cute this is. It says River Vixens, Riverdale. This is basically the cheerleader uniform top and I'm just obsessed. It is the cutest little crop top ever. I'm probably gonna end up using this as PJs because I don't have enough PJ tops. Like I don't know what it is, but I've got all the PJ bottoms but never enough tops. So this will be perfect for that and I can just, you know, catch up, Netflix and chill with myself watching Riverdale whilst wearing this top. And then the next item from the Riverdale collaboration I got is the jumper. This is so cute. So it basically just says Riverdale Vixen. I actually got this in a size medium because I really wanted that like very oversized kind of fit for me and it's already quite a big jumper anyway. I just wanted something to like really snuggle in and watch TV and that kind of thing and just be really cozy. Also this jumper was £10 but I feel like it's really really worth it because all of the Primark jumpers are so nice and cozy. Especially because most of them are really nicely lined with like this fleecy kind of fabric which makes it super warm. The next item I got is actually a pair of shoes. I didn't really know what to go for in terms of shoes because they had so many to choose from but I ended up going for a pair of mules because I have really got on into mules. Ever since I did that everything five pounds shoe haul, I actually got a pair of mules in that video and I was like, oh my God, these are so cute. And since then, I've been on the lookout for a really nice pair that I can just take on holiday or wear here. And I love these so much. I've got to say, these might not be everyone's cup of tea. They kind of look like grandma shoes, especially in this color. But personally, I really like these. I got these in a size five and they only cost eight pounds. Like eight pounds for a really nice, comfortable pair of shoes is not bad. Bad. Also the sole of them is like really nice and squishy so I feel like these are just gonna be perfect shoes for like a holiday just to slip on and be out the house. The next item I got is a really really adorable kind of like summer top I would say. This is it and <laughs> it's not really something I would usually go for because it's kind of like lacy but I absolutely love the shape and like the silhouette of it. So I just decided to get it, to give it a try. I feel like this would be really cute for a holiday. I feel like I'm talking about holidays a lot in this video, but just so you guys know, I'm planning on doing a lot more traveling this year with my fiance Matt and we do have a vlog channel as well, like together. We recently actually went to St. Lucia and we had such a great time and that's kind of like where I'm thinking about like the future already. I'm thinking about already what could be cute on like a holiday. We are planning on potentially going to Bali again this year so I'm really really excited for that and that's kind of why I'm doing like a holiday shop as well. But yes, this would be so cute on a holiday in like a really nice hot country because it's super lightweight. It's really breathable because of the fabric. I also found another top kind of along the same lines. It's very, very summer appropriate. It's just so adorable. I absolutely love the pattern of it. It's kind of like a checkered pattern, but I've never seen checkered patterns in this color. You guys know I love anything nude. Sadly, I didn't actually manage to find a size eight in this top, but I did get a size 10 and hopefully this should still fit me. Also, this top cost 11 pounds, which again, is not really that bad of a price to pay. It is a really cute top. The next item I got is actually a coat. It's very, very lightweight and it's kind of like a duster jacket, I would say. I feel like with this jacket, you could totally wear it now on like slightly warmer days or just wait for the spring, but I think it's really cute and really versatile. It's quite a formal jacket as well, which I don't really own many of, so I just decided to get this. This was £23, which again, is not bad. I really like the colour. It goes with a lot of things in my wardrobe, so I'm really excited for this. And the very last item I got is actually a bra, so this is literally the cutest little bra ever. I feel like it's very versatile. It's kind of like a t-shirt bra, but cute. It has got a tiny bit of texture, but I feel like it's not gonna show up underneath clothing, which is great. I just really like the Primark bras. I swear by their t-shirt bras, so I thought I would go for something a little bit extra. This was seven pounds, and I think this is their push-up kind of range, because it does have quite a lot of sponging. I think this is really cute, and I'm definitely gonna get a lot of use out of it. So that was everything for my Primark haul today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it entertaining slash helpful. I feel like 
because Primark doesn't have an online store. You can't really see what's in stock like all the time. So these videos really help me to see like what's in stock, whether it's worth going in. And I hope you guys found it entertaining. Let me know down below which one of these items was your favorite. I personally really, really like the bag. I think that's probably my favorite thing that I got. If you guys would like me to try out any other sort of like retailers or online stores to do with clothing or anything for that matter, then let me know in the comments what you would like me to try out next. But that is all from me. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Mwah.